The government says it will stop at nothing in the fight uh, against the illicit brew in the country. There is an event uh, in Karen on the same. Let's cross over and listen in. From the counties to be in attendance so that they can get instructions on the way forward on matters, drug abuse, drug and substance abuse. President William Ruto, who chairs the National Security Council, has given very clear and unequivocal instructions to us that the matter of drug and substance abuse has reached alarming proportions and is no longer a social issue but a serious threat to our national security. The government has therefore decided that this matter will be dealt with as an existential threat to the very existence of our republic because of what poison disguised as alcohol has done to our people. You are aware a few weeks ago in Krinyaga, innocent people bought unknowingly poisoned, thinking it is alcohol, and over 23 people are now reported dead, and others have gone blind. There are many other unreported deaths across the country, and this destruction of our most productive population, our young people. There has been challenges of enforcement. There has been challenges of licensing. And the problem has evolved into a serious national security threat. To start with, with the advent of devolution the 2010 Constitution conferred the powers to license alcoholic drinks to the counties. And that responsibility was being done by NACADA and the national government in a very responsible manner. Since the advent of devolution, counties have licensed almost every other establishment in our market centers and trading centers across the country to be an establishment for the sale of alcohol. Again, following the advent of...